3x3 is a half court game. It's played by four players. Three starts the game and then one substitute, making four. The game is played for 10 minutes with just one timeout. It, it doesn't stop. It's, it's always going on. When you make a basket, you don't need to stop for it to start again. The opponent picks the ball and then you start running. So the game is non stop 10 minutes. Unless there's a timeout or there's a foul or the ball goes out, it doesn't stop. There's no coach when the game is going on. So you have to just stay back and just watch them do what they can do. So if you are not able to give them what they really need for that 10 minutes, you can't correct them, you can't change anything, you can't add anything, you just have to watch them play. When I got into the university, I think there was one time that we had the opportunity to represent our school somewhere last year. By the grace of God, being our first major competition, we won. It's a very interesting game. I loved it and even I mean love it it's more than the regular basketball to be honest so I really love 3x3 so that's how come I got to know about 3x3 and so far um, it's been progressive where we are coming from even though basketball is in the shadows we have good coaches training us physically, mentally, and emotionally. So when it gets to the physicality of the game, no matter how big they are, no matter how small they are, we play our ball, we understand what we, we are about, and then we just deliver. I've suffered three major injuries in my career. The, the first one was 2021. That was my shoulder. So I went off for like six months, which was very difficult for me. I go back to 2023, January 1st, I had a knee injury, very bad. I went out for four months and it was very bad. But we look beyond our injuries. Injuries are part of the game. Personally, I've known Fred before this, this tournament. So he's not, he's not a new player to me. I've known him for a while. So. I know what he can do. You will try and uh, underrate him because of his size, but he does what big guys do. So for me, that's one thing I see about him. And I, I, I believe that he's going to use that, that energy for the team. He's, he's a great guy. He's a great leader too. So he's a captain of the team. 